hello everyone uh, in this video we will solve this question from gate 2017 exam okay it came for two marks uh, the question was that the spectroscopic data for an organic compound with the molecular formula c10 h12 o2 are given below okay and uh, the ir band is around 1750 cm inverse and the proton nmr uh, chemical shift values are 7.3 multiplet due to 5 hydrogens 5.385 uh, uh, quadrat 1 hydrogen and this is um, coupling constant value okay and likewise these values are given here so in the option we are having four compounds first is methyl 2 phenyl propionate one phenyl ethyl acetate third is two phenyl ethyl acetate and fourth one is methyl 3 phenyl propionate so uh, before solving it further we have to draw these these uh, name into the corresponding structures okay so for the first one that is methyl 2 phenyl propionate i will draw this so it will be like methyl okay so this will be like propionate okay and this is first carbon this is second carbon and towards the second carbon phenyl is attached to it okay so it becomes methyl see this is one this is two okay second one it is having a phenyl so methyl to phenyl propionate okay likewise uh, the b option that is one phenyl ethyl acetate that will be like okay so this is it acetate okay and this is ethyl and phenyl okay so on the first carbon it is phenyl and it is ethyl and it is it is acetate okay uh, for the third option that is uh, two phenyl ethyl acetate it will be like like this okay so it is what two phenyl ethyl acetate so on the first second carbon it is acetate uh, sorry for first and second carbon phenyl is attached to it so it is two phenyl ethyl acetate for option d that is methyl 3 phenyl propionate it will be like ch3 o c double bond o ch2 ch2 and this phenyl group okay this phenyl group okay so these are the structures of the compound which we are which you are given in the option you have to determine which is the correct one according to this formula uh, according to this uh, uh, data okay so this ir band around 1750 it uh, it suggests that there is a functional group there is easter functional group in the compound so in all the four compounds you are having easter functional group so that is uh, of no use for here okay now next one is this 7.3 chemical shift due to a multiple due to 5 hydrogen which is due to a presence of a phenyl group okay so this phenyl group is also present in all the four compounds so you don't have to worry about this so what comes the next is like you have to check that uh, this coupling constant values okay so these two coupling constant values are same so this proton and this proton are coupled with each other which protons are coupled with each other see it is having one hydrogen one proton and it is having three proton this is giving quartet this is giving doublet why this is giving quartet because it is attached to a carbon having three hydrogens that's why it is giving quartet okay one more than the number of hydrogens and this is giving doublet because it is attached to the carbon having one proton so it is giving doublet so what you can conclude from here that is there is something like ch3 ch group okay this group must be there see this is three pro uh, protons are here so this proton will give quartet and this proton will give these all three will give doublet because there is only one proton at adjacent to them so this group you have to check with um, where this group is present so it is present here in this one option and in this option in these two this is not present so you can eliminate these two options 
no you don't have to worry about these two options you just have to check these two options okay this uh, data that is uh, singlet three protons it is due to presence of a uh, methyl group okay so methyl group is present in both of them now you have to check out the value of chemical shift the value of chemical shift will give you the correct answer see in both these options this carbon or this proton here if this carbon is attached to another carbonyl uh, this is attached to carbonyl group carbonyl carbon okay but here this carbon is attached to oxygen a electronegative more electronegative group okay so what this electronegative group will do it will deshield this proton okay when it will deshield this proton its chemical shift value will increase okay so the the uh, the uh, proton having uh, giving quartet this was uh, this was the proton which was giving quartet due to these three hydrogens its chemical shift value should increase because of the presence of uh, this uh, electronegative group okay so this electronegative group is making uh, it deshielded and due to this its uh, chemical shift value is increasing so this data that is 5.85 uh, ppm of chemical shift quartet one hydrogen this is supporting this see what you have to check you have to just check that this this proton how it, uh, what is it the value of its chemical shift okay so this proton is having this or this both of them okay so we are not uh, concluded yet so these both of the protons you have to check this was the proton okay so you have to check this value this value is more than the usual value 5.85 is a higher chemical shift value this could be only achieved it if this proton is deshielded so you have to check in which of these cases the the proton is deshielded this one proton okay so among these two in this option this proton is deshielded due to presence of a electronegative group so the deshielding of this proton is causing increase in its chemical shift value and hence we are getting option 2 as the correct option okay uh, so thank you for watching hope you like the video Please like and subscribe our channel.